Flight crew, please prepare for takeoff. What's up and welcome to another full transparency trading session. I'm your host, Sebastian, and we are in on a trade at the moment off of a pullback. As you can see, we got in right here. It's starting to go positive. Uh, we like to see that run up all the way to the stop limit at 46. It's been doing this like several times over the past hour. So I want to just see if I can capitalize on one of these trades here and get this to push up to the upside for me. But you know me, I'll take profit anywhere I need to. But I would love to see this run all the way back up here to at least the 52.46 that we've been looking at earlier. But that's already $125. On the other side, I wasn't able to enter the trade. So what I'm going to do is I will uh, probably cancel this unless I think it might come back down and touch it one more time. But if it does, that's actually not working to my advantage. Let's go on over to the other side of the trade here. And let's watch our trade. Got to watch our trade. All right, so we're looking to move this up to about right here for take profit for the first take profit zone. If we can break out of these 60s and go to the 70s, it'll get to $200 pretty easily. And then we should stay in the 70s for a little bit. Let me go live. I'll go live. Nah, nah I don't have time to set up a live right now. I don't have time to set the live up. I need to watch my trade. So we're almost at $200. Once we get into the 70s, we'll be at 200 and we'll slide our take profit up to take that $200 no matter what. We're watching very hard right now. Don't like it rejecting off of the 90 MA. Want to get above that. Let's go to the one minute real quick just to see where the uh, rejection line is. So the rejection line's right here. Let's go ahead and set the alert there for when we cross up there. That's actually right where my take profit zone is for $200. Got in at 38, that's just over 41. So it's almost 300. Yeah, we should see this, it should run up. If we hit this, like I said, if we hit the 70s, we're gonna run up. And we're just gonna watch and we're gonna be patient. We're gonna go back to the five minute just to make sure we don't get any reversal dojis. Uh, I'll open this up in a minute to close. I'd love to see this jump to like $300 in a couple of seconds here going through the 70s. If we can get all the way back to 516, that'll take us all the way up here, which is about $800. So there's, like I said, when we get the 70s, we'll hit 200 bucks. This is just around 300. As always, we will take profit at whenever there is a need to take profit. I actually need to watch that one minute for just a second just to make sure we don't push up to the 200 EMA crossing up. Don't like that rejection. You need to see us go back up into it. But it's not bad because we didn't go through the 60s. If we went through the 60s, then it would have been, it would have been time to exit early. But it's always hard to stay in the 70s. That's normal. Usually what happens is you kind of waver in the 70s. You'll go down to 68 over and over again. And then eventually you'll pop from 70 to like 80, 85 area. So that is what we're watching for. But this is a good trade. This is a good trade. Got in right here. You see off the pullback. Got that little uh, reversal hammer right there. Almost a full hammer. Not quite. And we're just going to ride it up to the 200 EMA. We're not going to watch it on the one because, you know, the one will trick you, trick you out. I need to see us cross up over this line here. We're at 225. We are ready to lock in profit. 250. You see what I said? Like right there. How we got to the 80s really quickly. We're ready to lock in profit whenever. I want to see us get up to the $300 mark. If we can't close the 80s, I will close out in profit. You know me. We just want to see what happens in these 80s. Now we need to go back over to the one because we're getting icons that we are hitting the 200 EMA. We need to see if we cross up. We have crossed up into the 200 EMA. Oh, we want to see this thing fly. Like, let's go. Ready to close out. Like I said, always ready to close out off of, that, off of those rejections. But we got plenty of room to the upside. $275 is not a bad trade at all. $250 is a good trade too. We want to see if we can stay in these 80s. If we can stay in these 80s, we are good to go. But if we cannot stay in the 80s, we will close out our trade. Finger is on the trigger going once. 
going twice. Okay, we're pushing up in the 80s. Cool. $325 right there from uh, 86 cents. Like I said, if we get into the 90s, you're talking about 600 bucks. I'm always good to take 300. Like 300 is my first take profit area any day. Cool, we're going above the 200 DMA. That's always good news. Always, always, always good news. Never want to see a hard rejection right here. We want to see it keep climbing, keep climbing. There we go. There we go. That's what we like to see. Can we get 86 cents and I'll close out? Three, two, one. Okay, we broke above it. All right, we're waiting to see if we can get up above this uh, level right here that we came from. We're wicking up. Okay, cool, 350, there we go. Now, like I said, if we get into the uh, 516 area, once we hit 516, this thing is gonna take off for 600, 700, $800. But we're gonna slide our take profit area up. Click modify. Click modify. Stop filled. And we're taking 350. We don't play around. We're taking $350, guys. You already know how I get down. Hey, that's another good trade for $350 on this account right there. Yes, it's going to run up further. No, I don't give a darn because I want my profit. Every $350 is going to add up. If I get another $350, that's $700. I don't have to go for the home run right off the bat. I can just let this thing play up to a, re a reversal area, and then I can get back in later on. You see, I got in right here when we get the push up. If I get another symbol like that, I'll get right back into a trade. But that's it for another full transparency trading session. I am your host, Sebastian. And again, I'm out.